Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 17th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and this reading is not sign specific. So, what do we have for today? What do we have for today's episode? I don't know, but whatever's happening, I'm smiling. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. I'm smiling. Two of Cups, Two of Cups. So this is a union, a partnership with somebody that you are very compatible with. This could be a new union coming into fruition. This is a... Uh, compatibility take a look at it it's like both of these people they're looking at each other and they're like wow wow I mean they're like uh, mesmerized by each other so hmm hmm temperance reversed now this is uh, unbalanced. Something is unbalanced. Somebody may be impatient. This could be the female. It's on the female side, the feminine side. So this is a feeling of being impatient. Um, hmm. Ooh, oh, we could. This this could be sexually frustrated. We talked about this the other day. Okay, we could have a, a feminine that is sexually frustrated. I mean, by the look on her face, she's probably like, let's go. I mean, take a look at her face. She's like, yeah, all right. You know, I don't know if that will focus. There we go. I mean, she's like intently telling him something telepathically. I think in her head, she's saying, come on, let's go. <laughs> I think so. I think so. Something like that. Um, he's just probably waiting for her to open her mouth. Anyhow, um, we have somebody here that is definitely frustrated. There's a lack of passion in this person's life. Woo! The lovers! The lovers card. Now, I think that something is about to happen. Okay, something is about to happen. Could be dealing with a Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This could be the Libra energy that we are feeling. I'm not sure, but this is, uh, whew. I mean, this is, the roses are a symbol of love. And I just happened to notice the roses very prominently here. So there's an opportunity for love, obviously, on this day. This is a very seductive day. It's a very passionate day. I feel as though that this masculine is probably going to um, get the message that she is sending to him telepathically. He's going to get the message. Um, there is this is this is definitely a union, okay? That is absolutely positively meant to be. No doubt about it. None. I mean, look at it. It's a beautiful. Could be uh, dark and white. Okay. Could be there. Could be a. Uh, it could be either way. We could have, uh, you know, somebody coming together with a person of a different culture, a different, uh, ethnic background, right? Um, we definitely have two people coming together. No doubt about it. It's unexpected as well. It's definitely unexpected. It feels as though this masculine is going to love. It's like this masculine is going to love this person for who they are. You know, it's not about their... It's almost... I feel like it's not about their looks you know what i mean it is but it isn't you know what i'm trying to say it's like you can be yourself with this person you can just be yourself there's nothing to hide you don't have to be ashamed
Now this is blocking something. Avoiding somebody is, is they may be afraid. They may be afraid. If you are afraid that you are not good enough for this connection, that is just a fear. That is just a fear, okay? If you're afraid that you're not good enough, that is just a fear. It's like somebody may have their guard up because they feel like they're, it's like they're ashamed of their body. I don't, that's what I get when I look at this card. Don't be ashamed. This person is going to love you. This person is going to love you for who you are. There's nothing to be ashamed of. This person sees inside. They, they have, there's a mental connection here. There's a spiritual connection. The, the connection goes much deeper than what is on the outside. And this is like, uh, this, this is so sudden. It feels like it's so sudden that it feels like that's where the wows came from. It's like, this is so sudden. It's like, where did this come from? Where did this come from? Magician reversed. Now, this is very cunning. This is very crafty. This is a Gemini, and this is a Gemini. Somebody could be dealing with a Gemini, just saying. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius as well. But this is unable to take action. We have somebody here that hasn't been taking any action. Could have been because of fear. Fear of the unknown. Fear of maybe even being rejected. I mean, we have this feminine who may be fearful of being rejected. Just saying. There's definitely fear of rejection here. This person hasn't been using their resources. They haven't found their resources within to make a move. Like, paralyzed. Seriously. But this, there's such a deep connection here of some sort. This is a deep connection. It's like... It's almost like it's a it's an unavoidable connection as well. King of Cups reverse now. Mm, seven of Pentacles. This is investment. Thinking about is it worth it? Do I have enough to offer? Should I give my heart away? Should I open up my heart? Should I take action? Can I do this? Am I strong enough? Do I have the strength? Do, can I provide? Can I do this? Am I good enough? That's what I feel with this. I feel like we have somebody here that is really thinking about investing in a union. It's like they see a connection and they want to do it, but they're, they're so fearful. They're so fearful. And we have somebody here that just, it's like they're, they can't master their emotions and find their resources to take action, but they really want to definitely thinking about it. Meanwhile, the other person is getting very frustrated sexually waiting for this lover to show up. But this lover, this 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 lover is here. This lover sees a connection they do. They do. Um somebody may have a choice because this is a choice and this is a choice, a choice between two people. And it could have it could have happened unexpectedly. Somebody may have unexpectedly developed a connection out of the blue. They may have you know tested the waters and you know got a response, and and it was just like, oh yeah, I guess there is really a connection here. And now they got to make some sort of choice as to you know what they want to invest in, who they want to invest in. You want this one or you want that one? That kind of thing. So. Ooh, we do have an ending here. This is an ending. This is a this is a a change. We do have a change. Ooh, this is a card of transformation. This is a card of transformation. So somebody is really stuck. Really, 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 really stuck. It's like they're facing the end if they don't make a move. 
and they just don't have the resources within them. They, they can't master their emotions. They, they can't speak. They're trying to avoid uh, getting rejected. They're fearful. They want to uh, take action. They're thinking about it, but they can't make a move. They cannot. They can't because fear is so great. This is fear. And it's like it's going to end. It, it's going to end if you don't. So this is something that has potential to go downhill really fast if somebody doesn't take action. We have somebody here that um, just isn't or can't master their emotions and go after what their heart wants, but they feel a connection. They probably also feel that they are losing somebody. They're losing a connection to somebody else. They may see it. It's like they know that they're losing a connection because they aren't taking action, right? I mean, that's what we have here. We have somebody here that just cannot find the willpower and the discipline to follow their heart. They're definitely thinking about it, but they're they're trapped in their own thoughts. And now whoever it is that they are thinking about has a new opportunity. And they know it. They know it. This is a new opportunity. Somebody has a new beginning here. They do. A new beginning in love. And it's because... The person that they were waiting on didn't make a move. And now somebody else is making a move. That's what I see. It's the end of loneliness. It is. This is the end of loneliness. It's like all of a sudden somebody shows up. Somebody may be making a decision, because this is a decision that they have been avoiding. Somebody is making a decision that they have been avoiding to invest in somebody else. And I think what they were doing was they were, they were unable to release something. They were unable to release, but it's like we've had this shift. We've had this shift in energy. But I think now, now they've, they've basically decided that I'm ready. I'm ready for a union. I'm ready for a partnership. I'm ready for love. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. And I think both two people that have been in a state of resistance for a, a period of time are now ready. It's like they're now ready and they're coming together. The lover's card is like Cupid or an angel bringing two people together at the right time, at the right place, under the right circumstances. But this temper, this is like very frustrated. This is sexually frustrated. So... I think it's the feminine that is sexually frustrated here. And that's odd, I know, but it's not, okay? But usually people talk about males, but I'm just saying we have somebody here that is frustrated and it's like they're sick of being alone, absolutely. And there's another opportunity here to start with somebody new. I think this is a this is a new prospect, the Five of Cups. I'm done crying. I'm done moping. I'm done waiting. I'm done giving my power away to somebody who doesn't love me. This is, I'm done giving my power away to somebody that doesn't love me. I'm, this is stalling, done stalling. I'm done going nowhere. It's time to invest. So we have somebody here that is, is, is starting to invest in something else. And I think it's going to grow, even though this one is reversed. Whatever it is that they were crying about, there's no growth there. And this is like coming out of coming out of the cave. It's like I'm done living in hibernation. I'm done. So we do have a new beginning here. The, the endings bring new beginnings. So I think we have somebody here that has got, gotten frustrated with holding on. And 
it's 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 time to live again it is time to live again so i feel like today is a day of going after this person that is really ready we have the nine of pentacles here the nine of pentacles is a self-sufficient person who is enjoying life is very grateful for everything has has experienced a lot of of trials and has overcame them and has worked really hard to pick themselves up from rock bottom and knows their value and knows their worth and everybody can see it and this person who is basically right in their glory enjoying life doing very well is about to uh this is a very independent energy this person isn't it's like they're not even looking i'm not even looking i'm not looking for love i'm not doing anything and here comes somebody here comes somebody to swoop them right up by the looks of things it's almost like steal them away from the person that didn't love them here comes your your in this case this is like your hero i mean this person is like you know i'll take that if if you don't want it i will this is this is this is a this is abundance. This is a, a person that is very abundant, stable, solid, a hard, 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 hard worker. Beautiful as well. So we have this independent person who's been working on themselves that isn't even looking. This person may have been blocking and protecting themselves. You know, this is self-protection. It is protecting themselves from falling in love but they, they it's like suddenly there is somebody that they have a connection with it is sudden i know that it is it's like it's like that saying it comes when you least expect it that's what this is you're not expecting it you're not looking for it you're doing your own thing and and here this person just comes to swoop away it's like it's like steal the prize It's like somebody else's delay, somebody's inability to take action is opening a door for somebody. It opened the door. It did. It opened the door. This is a card of love he heals. So this is a healing love. I feel like we have somebody here that is, they may even be willing to relocate. This person could be at a distance and they be, may be like, you know, I can relocate. I, I will relocate to you or you can relocate to me. Th these are both going down. These are both going down. So there is something that is going down. There is a, I think it's a new love. It's a new love partnership. It's a new love connection. There's a love or there's a past love connection that is going down and there is a new one beginning. Endings bring new beginnings. There is a new love prospect here. It is the end of loneliness. If somebody can open their heart And find their resources to take action. We have one person here that is absolutely ready. This person is independent and ap and ready. This person is ready. And it's like this. It feels like we have a, somebody that is going to come in and offer this person something it's like I, I i have something for you can we can we do something you know can we start something i'd like to start something with you i don't think they say those words it's like but they they definitely are thinking about it heavily they're thinking about this independent person who is is the prize it's like that's the prize i want that prize we also have the person that didn't take action that has a lot of regrets, by the way. The person that didn't take action, the person that couldn't open their heart, knows that their person is about to be in 
in a new connection, put it that way. They know it. They know that somebody is coming to take their prize. So rest assured, whoever the person is that hurt you and caused you so much pain and didn't invest and didn't move forward and didn't follow through with their plans and manipulated and lied and tricked and duped, they are about to lose. Another man's trash is another man's treasure. We talked about this the other day. We do have two people that are coming together. There's no doubt. This is a divine connection. Somebody has find their, found their strength to persevere through, a, persevere through a very tricky situation. They've persevered. They have risen from the deception. They have risen from the deceit. They have risen from the betrayal and the lies. And this person is about to receive some sort of uh, new love connection for rising and dealing with it and not going back. So there is a reward. This is a reward. There's a reward coming. Somebody is about to be working together with somebody else by the looks of things. Somebody that will actually put in effort and not give up. You could meet this person through your job. You know, you meet them through your work or their work or something like that. It's like this person is working away and maybe you work together in some way. They come to talk to you or something like that. You're working away and there's some sort of conversation that opens things up. That's what I have. Good luck.